We are following breaking news at this hour out of Jedsonia. Authorities there confirming they are investigating a shooting involving law enforcement. Fox 16's Mitch McCoy joining us live from Jetsonia now with more. Mitch. Yeah, Kevin and Donna, good evening. We're right off of Highway 357 and 157. I'm going to walk you through exactly what a witness just told me a few moments ago. There's a lot of moving parts to this. And what that witness told me is that the suspect actually drove up here to this, what is a, a car wash and apartment building. You kind of think of it as a, a, a duplex of, of some kind. You have a car wash here. You have apartments on the other side. A police car came up. A Judsonia police officer came up through here, kind of blocked the suspect off and that's when the suspect took off into the tree line here according to that witness he tells me that uh, the suspect was approaching officers with a knife and that is when he heard gunshots take a listen to what that witness told me he did immediately after hearing gunshots after I heard the gunshots um, of course I head over to the field and one of the officers had come to the to the fence line over there and uh, told him who I was and what I'd done and if they needed my help and he said yes sir so got my trauma pack went over and started treating the patient what'd you do um, just basically there wasn't much I could do until the unit got there um, just uh, you know apply pressure control some bleeding and, and keep him conscious monitor his vitals you know that man, a former paramedic, and we're told at this point that the man is in critical condition, according to some of his family members tonight. It is unclear at this point, but uh, what, from what we're hearing is that there were no officers injured during this incident. So, Kevin and Donna, still a lot of moving parts of this, but we are told this was a Jetsonia police officer. And according to that witness, the suspect, according to that witness, was involved in some kind of break-in before he was being chased by Judsonia police officers. Back to you. Well, I tell you one thing, it was a good thing that former paramedic was there because he knew exactly what to do. A lot of people in a situation like that may not have known. Oh, absolutely. And he tells me that he uh, quickly went up and he lives right across here next to the car wash uh, spots here for vehicles. He went up, grabbed his trauma kit. He said that he applied pressure to two gunshot wounds. But he says that that man, uh, the suspect who was shot by police, was conscious before being loaded into an ambulance. Mm, okay. All right, Mitch, thank you very much. This is a story we broke on our Fox 16 News smartphone app to be the first to get breaking news alerts just like this one. You can download the app for free. You'll find it in the App Store or Google Play.